The Salem K. Motipe Schools Cup was initiated by President Patrice Motipe in memory of his mother and the integral role she played in his life. The final took place in Bloemfontein this year and attracted a crowd of football enthusiasts, dignitaries and celebrities all keen to see who would go home with a million rand on offer for the winning team. My mother was a teacher with my father and they supported and loved football before my parents went into business and there's always been an obligation on all of us, on us in particular, to make a humble contribution towards the development of football at schools level and I'm very proud that in partnership with the local government, the provincial government, as well as the national government, SASFA and the various teachers and the teams that participated in the Sanlam Kemuse Bay, it's growing and the talent is improving, so the future looks good. The final was contested between the School of Excellence from Gauteng and East High School in Pumalanga, but the entertainment didn't stop there. It's an absolute stunning day. We have the best two teams playing right now. We have Zahara performing. We've got DJ Cleo performing. We've got Professor performing. What else would you want as a funful day with good soccer being played and with the best artists in this country performing for the crowds? The teams ousted Rosina Siribani and last year's winners Harmony High in the semi-finals to book a chance at the final. One thing that I'm very much concerned about whenever I'm dealing with the players is the confidence that they have. I instill a lot of discipline tactical discipline and make sure that they play their normal way and they must have confidence in whatever they do. They, they mustn't change from what you've done in training. It was only the second time East High School had entered the tournament but their first trip to the final and they were to take on stiff competition. The School of Excellence has some serious pedigree. Some of them are going to be the future players of this country because that is what we really need for soccer. Because in rugby and in cricket we've got it right with having a proper feeding system. And in soccer we're still struggling to get it right. And the Sunlam Kemo Tepe Schools Cup is the place where the young talent is. That is why we have invited all the scouts to come out because we need these young players for the first division teams and for the PSL clubs and also then for the national squad as well. In order to make a tangible difference to the winners, no actual money will be given to the school. Instead, they'll present a wish list of items they need to enhance the development of the school or sporting infrastructure. The relevant stakeholders of the competition will then facilitate the wish list, leaving behind a lasting legacy for the winners. One of the biggest gifts we can give our children is quality education. The most successful countries in the world are the countries that have invested in education. So in the companies that we are involved in, we educate children and spend money building schools, building classrooms, building laboratories. And uh, the Sanlam K Mutsipe is another initiative that we use to help with uh, the development of education, both amongst teachers and amongst the students. At the end of full time, the two teams were deadlocked in a 2-2 draw. It was time to see whose nerves would hold better under the pressure of a penalty shootout. In our training, we practice a lot of penalties. I know it's a nerve-wracking exercise to decide a match in that manner. It's difficult for any team. It's part of training. They, they must go through this at their younger age. By the time they go to the professional level, then they're used to this environment. Then they can do it much easier. At least they've got an experience. with the School of Excellence winning 6-5 on penalties. I'm told that approximately 3,000 schools participated this year and we hope that we'll have more schools next year. And I'm excited to see the, the passion, the commitment, the encouragement that the Sanlam K. Mutsipe Schools Tournament has provided to develop schools at local level as well as throughout the country. Congratulations, gentlemen. We can't wait to see what legacy you'll leave behind for future students.